Hi, welcome back to AQA Certificate Further Mathematics GCSE. Today we're on Chapter 5.3, Intersection of Graphs. This is a great A video. I hope you enjoy it, and let us start. So, what is meant by intersection of two lines? Basically, it is um, finding a point where those two equations are equal to each other, and as long as those two lines are straight, which is y equals mx plus c, then there will only be one answer. But if it is a quadratic equation like x squared plus 2x plus 1, then it's going to be a bit more tricky to find out what's the solution. But basically, those two are equal. Okay, so I have um, drawn a graph, kind of, and yeah, in order to get a beautiful answer for you guys, I need to make a weird and random equation, but let it be, it works, so why not? Um, so now, we have two equations. How do we approach? without like reading off the graph and you can kind of guess it there but you can't because I just sketched it okay so the first thing you do is to make those two equal so the first step is to make y equal to y so the equation will be equal to y equal y and that's it that's all just kidding Nope, that is a random one. We have to use the x term because we can only solve the x term because there are coefficients and with coefficients and numbers we can solve equations and if you do remember how to solve the equation you can start. Yep, okay, so by multiplying everything by 3 you get this then you rearrange, you get this, then you divide all by 7, x equals 1. There you go. So now we have one x answer. How do we find that y? Well, substitute this number into any one of those two equations. So either this complicated one or this easy one. Guess what I'm going to do? I'll substitute into the easy one. So y equals 2x, then y is equal to 2 times 1, which is 2. So yeah, there we go. So the final equation, uh, well, final point is 1, 2. There we go. So that is the answer to solving these kind of intersection points. And it's also called kind of simultaneous equations where both sides are equal. Well, yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, a key thing to note is that when those two lines cross, they have the same answer uh, or they have the same y value. And so we can calculate that and find out what's the x value then solve it with the original equation to find the y value and that will give you the points, the exact pinpoints of where they cross just remember that the two sides are of the correct um, thing not like y equals y, it's just random and yeah, basically rearrange and you get the answer. And now I have created three graphs, kind of, uh, three uh, of two lines, which is six lines, obviously, and I want you to find for each group of the um, equations, I want you to find out their crossing points and these won't be a like beautiful number because I just randomly tapped 
on my keypad and just yeah basically I made it up and I don't know what's the answer either so I have to do it myself and so you have a bit of time to pause the video and I'll come right back there we go um, these are the points that is on that well these are the crossing points of those equations so it seems like I've made a correct like beautiful kind of answer but I really just well let's say that's fluke oh well and um, that's it for this video thank you guys for watching I'll see you next time